Life can often lead us through difficult seasons filled with loss and regret, leaving us with the feeling that valuable years have been squandered. However, the promise found in God's Word reassures us that He can restore all those wasted years. This divine assurance is beautifully articulated in Joel 2 verse 25, where God states that He will restore the years that the swarming locust has consumed. This means that, regardless of the hardships, mistakes, or uncontrollable circumstances that seem to have robbed us of our time and opportunities, God has the power to make things right once again. To truly grasp this promise, we must reflect on the experiences of the people of Israel. They endured a devastating locust plague that obliterated their crops and fundamentally disrupted their way of life, which was in part a consequence of their disobedience to God. Yet, in His boundless mercy, God vowed to restore what they had lost. This promise extended beyond merely returning their crops and livelihoods. It encompassed a holistic renewal of their spirits. God's desire was to mend their broken hearts, draw them closer to Himself, and shower them with abundant blessings. In our own lives, wasted years can manifest in various ways. They might involve time spent chasing goals that failed to yield success, relationships that ended in heartbreak, health struggles that hindered us from fully engaging in life, or even periods when we felt spiritually barren and disconnected from God. Such wasted years can overwhelm us with a profound sense of loss, leading to feelings of hopelessness and despair. Nevertheless, the promise of restoration that God offers surpasses these losses. He is not confined by time. His ability to redeem and restore is boundless. No matter how many years you perceive to have been wasted, God has the capacity to transform them when you place your trust in Him. When you entrust your life to God, He initiates a process of healing and renewal that exceeds your wildest imagination. One of the pivotal ways He restores wasted years is by turning your pain into purpose. This transformation is not only about reclaiming what was lost, but also about reawakening your spirit and allowing you to fulfill the destiny He has designed for you. By embracing this divine process, you can discover a renewed sense of hope, direction, and fulfillment in your life, emerging from the ashes of regret to embrace a future filled with promise and possibility. Romans 8.28 serves as a powerful reminder that God orchestrates every situation for the good of those who love Him and who have been called according to His divine purpose. This profound truth implies that every experience we endure, regardless of how painful or challenging it may be, is never wasted when it is placed in God's capable hands. Instead, He skillfully uses these experiences to mold us, develop our character, and prepare us for the future He has meticulously planned for us. The trials and tribulations we encounter can evolve into compelling testimonies of God's unwavering faithfulness. During the times we face difficulties, it is common to feel isolated and overwhelmed. Yet, as we put our trust in God and begin to recognize His presence at work in our lives, our faith is strengthened. These moments of adversity not only allow us to witness His grace and mercy firsthand, but also facilitate the transformation of our pain into a narrative of hope and redemption. Furthermore, the experiences we undergo can become valuable tools for assisting others who find themselves in similar situations. When we openly share our stories of how God has guided us through challenging times, we can provide comfort and encouragement to those who are struggling, offering them reassurance that they are not alone in their hardships. Our testimonies have the potential to instill hope in others demonstrating that God's restorative power is also available to them. In addition, the process of restoration that God provides often entails a renewal of joy and hope. Psalm 51, 12 expresses this beautifully, reminding us to seek restoration of the joy that comes from our salvation and to request a willing, a willing spirit that sustains us. 
This verse highlights that when we approach God in our brokenness, He fills us with a profound sense of joy that transcends our immediate circumstances. When we feel weighed down by the burdens of our past, God's joy has the power to uplift us. This joy is not contingent upon our circumstances, but is deeply rooted in His unwavering love and acceptance. It is a source of delight that assures us we are cherished and valued by God, who has a good and purposeful plan for our lives. This divine joy empowers us to face each new day with a renewed sense of hope, reminding us that God is in control of our lives. Regardless of what challenges may arise, we can trust Him to care for us and guide us through. This assurance enables us to release past regrets and fears, allowing us to step into the future with renewed confidence and optimism. When God rejuvenates your joy, it simultaneously revitalizes your hope, allowing you to perceive possibilities where there once seemed to be only obstacles. You start to cultivate a belief that positive experiences are indeed attainable, and that your existence can be imbued with deep meaning and purpose. This renewed sense of hope invigorates your spirit and inspires you to chase the dreams and aspirations that God has placed within your heart. Along with this restoration of joy, God also redeems your lost years by presenting you with fresh opportunities and blessings. The declaration in Isaiah 43 verse 19 emphasizes this transformative power, illustrating how God can bring forth new beginnings from what once appeared to be desolate and unproductive circumstances. This scripture signifies that where there was previously emptiness and desolation, God has the ability to generate new life. He opens doors that seem permanently shut and provides blessings that exceed your greatest expectations. It is all too easy to feel disheartened when you believe you have squandered time or missed significant opportunities. Yet God is continuously at work, creating fresh pathways and possibilities for you. He transforms your deserts into flourishing spaces of renewal and abundance, exemplifying His grace and capacity to make all things new. Often these new beginnings come in unexpected forms, whether through a new job offer, the arrival of a meaningful relationship, or a fresh start in a setting you had never envisioned. Each of these blessings serves as a powerful reminder that, with God, nothing is insurmountable, and He can bring about goodness even in the most challenging situations. When God bestows new opportunities and blessings upon you, it is a clear indication of His profound love and concern for your well-being. His desire is for you to thrive and reach your fullest potential. These new beginnings also present a chance for you to deepen your faith and trust in Him. As you embrace these fresh opportunities, you can move forward with the confidence that God is walking alongside you, guiding and providing for you at every turn. Moreover, God's restoration is comprehensive, impacting every facet of your life. He does not merely address one aspect. Instead, He brings healing and renewal to your entire being. God seeks to heal your broken heart, repair your relationships, restore your health, and refresh your mind. Where there was previously chaos, He brings peace, and where confusion reigned, He offers clarity. By surrendering your past to Him, you invite Him to initiate a transformative work within you and through you, leading to a profound metamorphosis. This transformation transcends mere changes in your circumstances. It focuses on changing you from the inside out, reflecting God's intention for you to live a life that is both abundant and fulfilling. God's healing extends to your emotional wounds, providing comfort and peace in areas of deep hurt and pain. He repairs the shattered places within your heart, empowering you to forgive and release past grievances. This healing opens the door for you to experience joy and freedom in ways you may have never thought possible. In your relationships, God's restoration promotes reconciliation and renewal, 
aiding you in mending broken connections, strengthening bonds, and fostering healthy, loving interactions. This divine restoration cultivates a sense of community and belonging, enabling you to uplift and support one another. God also focuses on restoring your physical well-being, granting you strength and vitality to overcome illness and fatigue. His healing power revitalizes your body, allowing you to live with energy and enthusiasm. In your mind, God brings renewal by transforming your thoughts and perspectives, helping you to release negative patterns of thinking while embracing a mindset filled with hope and positivity. This mental rejuvenation equips you with the clarity and focus necessary to pursue your goals and dreams. It is essential to remember that God's restoration encompasses every aspect of your life, leading to a comprehensive transformation that enriches your entire being. God's timing is always impeccable, even if you may feel an urgent desire for immediate restoration. While you might long for swift healing or resolution, God understands the optimal moment and method for bringing about that restoration. Trusting in His divine timing necessitates both faith and patience, but it also offers you an opportunity to grow closer to Him as you navigate the waiting period. During this time, God teaches you to depend on His strength and to find genuine contentment in His presence. Rather than viewing this waiting period as wasted time, it transforms into a meaningful season of growth and preparation. You learn to lean on God more fully, recognizing that His ways and timing are always the most beneficial. In this transformative phase, God diligently works on your heart and mind, shaping you to be fully ready for the blessings and restoration He has in store for you. As you endure this waiting, you cultivate a deeper faith, gaining confidence in God's unwavering faithfulness and the assurance that He will fulfill His promises at the appointed time. Although this waiting period can be quite challenging, it simultaneously serves as a rich opportunity for spiritual growth. During this time, you develop virtues such as patience, perseverance, and trust, allowing you to appreciate God's presence in your life on a much deeper level. You begin to notice his influence in the small, the everyday moments that often go unnoticed. Ultimately, when God's restoration finally arrives, it surpasses anything you could have envisioned. You find that not only have you been restored, but you have also been transformed by the journey of waiting and trusting in him. This experience equips you to embrace the fullness of his promises and live a life brimming with his grace. The restoration of wasted years stands as a profound reflection of God's immense love and mercy, illustrating His delight in blessing His children and turning their mourning into joy. Psalm 30 eloquently expresses this transformation, celebrating how God can turn sorrow into dancing and replace mourning with joy, ensuring that your heart sings His praises. When God brings about restoration, he does so abundantly, filling your heart with gratitude and giving you a testimony of His goodness. Regardless of how many years you may feel have been squandered, God assures you that He will restore them. His restorative work is multifaceted, bringing purpose out of pain, joy out of sorrow, and new opportunities where doors once seemed shut. By trusting in His timing and surrendering your past to Him, you can be confident that He will make all things new. God's love for you is limitless, and His capacity to redeem your life is boundless. With God, the best is always yet to come, and your wasted years will stand as a testament to His incredible grace and power. Let us pray together, Heavenly Father. I come before you today with a heart brimming with hope and faith, lifting up those who are listening to this prayer. May your presence envelop them as they seek your guidance and restoration. Lord, we place our unwavering trust in your promise to restore all the years that have felt wasted. We understand that life is filled with various seasons, characterized by love, loss, regret, and pain. Yet, we stand firm on your word, 
believing that you will bring healing and renewal to every facet of our lives. Father, I lift up to you all the moments and years that appear to have been consumed by hardships, mistakes, or circumstances that were beyond our control. For each individual present, just as you have assured us in the scriptures, I ask that you restore to them the years that the locusts have devoured. I implore you to pour out your mercy and grace upon them, allowing them to witness your hand at work, bringing forth new life and blessings where once there was desolation. I pray for those who feel weighed down by their past, burdened by regrets, or engulfed by sorrow. Lord, I ask that you transform their mourning into joyful dancing and replace their sadness with exuberant joy. Fill their hearts with the joy of your salvation and grant them a willing spirit that sustains them through life's challenges. Help them to trust in your perfect timing and to find true contentment in your presence, even during the waiting period. I believe that you are actively doing a new thing in their lives, and I ask that you open their eyes to recognize it. Make pathways in the wilderness and create streams in the wasteland, bringing forth new opportunities and blessings that surpass their expectations. Let their trials serve as powerful testimonies of your faithfulness and as tools for helping others heal from their struggles. Heal their broken hearts, mend their relationships, restore their health and renew their minds. Bring peace to places of turmoil and clarity to areas of confusion. As they surrender their past to you, work in every aspect of their lives to facilitate complete transformation. Father, I express my gratitude for your incredible love and mercy, and I praise you for your faithfulness and the abundant restoration you provide. Fill their hearts with a profound sense of gratitude and bestow upon them a testimony of your goodness that they may share with others. In the mighty name of Jesus, I pray for all of this, believing that every blessing contained in this prayer is now upon each individual. If this prayer has resonated with you, please type, Amen. I urge you to spread God's word by sharing this video with a friend or family member. May the grace and peace of our Lord Jesus Christ envelop you all.